Hey moviegoers, this is the Movie Creek, and welcome back to another channel update. I have been on a bit of a hiatus since my recent review, and most of that is because of college. And what a ride that's been so far. I wanted to make sure that I stayed on top of things, and as of now, I've been doing a pretty good job at it. I made a few friends, and over the past two months, I've made some memories, and I can't wait to see what happens next. Enough about that, though. It's time that I start talking about the future of this channel for the rest of the year. I still want to make movie reviews, and there are still some films that I want to see, need to see, before the year ends. But being on a little hiatus allowed me to come up with an idea. An idea that I wanted to do for a long time now. As you all know, I am the movie critic, it's in the name, and I make movie reviews for movies that I watch throughout the year. And while that can be fun, I am in college now and it's hard for me to go to the movie theaters whenever I want to, as I don't really have a car yet, so yeah, and a license. What I can do is talk about movies of the past, movies that I've grown up with, and movies that I've grown to love in the past few years. But I feel it would be just a little bit boring to do in a movie review format. Before going into 2020, I wanted to make content that would be creative. And I have gotten a little bit artistic in my recent reviews, but it wasn't enough as I wanted to do something different. I wanted to make movie video essays. In my spare time, I've been watching video essays and the recent one that I watched was a five hour long essay about Nickelodeon Sam and Cat made by the YouTuber Quentin Reviews. Yes, I said five hours and it's amazing. I've always found the process of video essays to be very interesting and it's something that I wanted to try out but I never had an idea of what I wanted to do until now. A video essay, well video essay series to be specific, that is three videos total each talking about a series of films, trilogies. I call the video series Terrific Trilogies. This series will go over three film trilogies that I think are great or hold a special place in my heart. Now, I'm not sure if I want to disclose on what those three trilogies are, but I'll give a description, question mark, yeah. The first trilogy is something that I've grown up with, and it's something I believe still holds up to this day with its main characters and their chemistry. The second trilogy is a series that I wasn't introduced to as a child, but found out about it years later and have loved it ever since, with one of the films in the trilogy being in my top 10 favorite films of all time. The third and final trilogy of the Terrific Trilogy series is a series of films that have, as of recent memory, seen a resurgence in fans thanks to a new continuation series based on the events of the original trilogy. Now, I'm not sure when I'll post these video essays. I mean, I know they won't be simultaneously. I might post a video essay and then do some movie reviews in between. But who knows how long the process will be as I will be doing something that I have never done for a video before. And that is creating a script. Whenever the first video does get posted up, I will do something that I have never done before. I will host my first premiere video and I don't know how it's going to turn out. Maybe it won't turn out the way that I thought it would. but. I just think it'd be something cool to try out. Who knows how it will turn out. Maybe it will be good. Who knows? But yep. Terrific trilogies. I really am excited for this series. And if you guys end up enjoying it, then I might consider making more video essays in the future that aren't about trilogies. They might be about movies or TV shows, maybe, or certain, a certain scene from a movie. Who knows, we'll see how it goes. This will take the channel to new heights as we are inching closer 
on the road to 100 subscribers. And we are so close to meeting that goal with only five miles left to go. And we'll see if we can make that goal before the end of the year or how it looks now, maybe before October ends. But that'll do it for the channel update. If you did enjoy the video, make sure to smack that like button, subscribe, and hit the notification bell on the side to get information on videos in the near future. I hope you all have a great day or night wherever you are, moviegoers. This is The Movie Critic, and that's a wrap.